I don't trust my eyes. Something here is afoot. Nope. Okay. This is the bullshit. Bullshit fans. Uh, uh, come on. Oh. Come on, let me, let me get you. Hook shot. Wait, did, did the hover boots not help with fans? I thought they helped. Maybe they don't, you just have to wait. Huh, I thought you could be immune to them. Oh, I need hover boots for this though. But I just gotta wait, okay. Okay, and here's some bullshit. Um, arrows seem like they might help out. What does it do? Nothing? Alright. Oh, it just shoots fireballs at me. Okay. That was tricky. Fireball shoot. Oh no! It's boss time. Ugh, redeads. You just aren't what you used to be. You used to scare me. But no, no more. Now you can just be hit a couple times with the sword. Why would I want to go back? Wait, was there a key room somewhere? Here, I can hear the spirits whisper in this room. Those who have sacred feet should let the wind guide them. Oh. That is not something that I had considered. So this room wasn't necessary, it was just a big, hey, idiot, you missed the actual room type thing. Uh, where is the actual room? Right here. Oops. Well, that didn't work out too well. I lost an entire heart for that. That is some grade A bullshit. Okay. Now I'm beeping again. And another locked door with mummies. This is a nightmare. And now the mummy is scaring me with its blood curdling shriek and I'm wearing stupid hover boots and it's gonna bite on my neck and kill me unless I hit it in the face but now pots are trying to get me uh oh no okay Ooh. that was horrifying but don't worry what that's not what I wanted at all <laughs> I got a quarter of a heart ah, this game sometimes I tell you I tell you what is this a heart? A nut? Who needs a nut? Dumb. Yeah, Blue rupees. Oh, shit! I thought it was on the other side. That's okay. That's just fine. Wait, I don't have a key. Where... Oh, okay. Um, I believe this is the thing I have to blow up. I remember this now. Which... Yeah, which may be one of the better hidden keys in this game. Because I just barely remembered that was a thing. And it's kind of out of the way and hard. And then when you blow it up, there's nothing there. And it's an invisible chest. That's... Ah, uh, that's some bullshit. Okay. Um, again, terrible wall textures here. Got this block. I think I'm close to the end of this temple. Because I think this boat basically takes you to the final like boss. Unless I'm just horribly misremembering things. Probably that. Probably just horribly misremembering things. Black pushing time. They should call this block pushing, block pusher of time, because that's all you do in this game is just push gigantic blocks. 
in the different places. And another skel or, uh, Skeltula is in this room. There must be like 20 of them in the Shadow Temple. They should call it the Skeltula Temple. Whoever just named everything this game did a really bad job. Okay, now... What's over there? Hearts? I don't need hearts. I don't need any of that shit. Is there something else I should go check just in case? Maybe there's a key or something. Like the boss key and I just miss it. Now there's nothing. Nothing. What I need is on this boat. That's what I need. Gotta play a song too? So needy, but okay. Alright, now this is the part I remember having Stealthos drop on you while you're on the boat. And my question is, do I have to defeat them or can I just wait it out? Because Stealthos are very difficult with three hearts. If I had 12 hearts, it'd be no problem. You just tank them, but that is not an option. I could try to hammer them. I could try shooting them with my slingshot, but adults can't use slingshots for reasons unknown. This is also how boats work. Maybe there's just the one. That's not too bad if that's the case. Oh, I never equip my shield, I just realized. I was trying to use my shield, but I don't have it out. So that's stupid. Oh, that's not bad. I can just, like, keep my distance and... Oh, now there's two. Okay. Uh, just gotta wait for him to strike and don't get cornered by the other one. Alright, but he's gonna come back to life now in a little bit unless... Nope, he just burned up. Okay, I think I'm fine. Alright, Stealthos. This is much easier than it used to be in the Forest Temple. I think it was just the music that intimidated me in the Forest Temple. All those chanters and hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-
that's all I wanted. Like, here's an example of a difference between the 3DS version and this version. Um, there's just blood on this, like, torture chamber thing. Like, that's horrific. That is not in a children's game on the 3DS version. Um, walk past all these assholes, because who needs them, right? I don't think I don't think I need to be in any of those doors because I have the key. Unless there are more keys. But if that's the case, I'll come back. You know? Wait, I have a map. Um I need the boss key. Maybe one of those has the boss key. Maybe? Nah, I think I think it doesn't. I think I'm okay. I think I'm okay. If not, I can always go back. But I think that'd be a pretty shitty place for a boss key. Alright, magic. What do we got here? Arrows. Lots of magic and arrows I can see. Almost like I'll need both of those things in the boss room. And there is a boss key. So maybe I do have to take a trip back to that shitty little maze. Uh, that's okay. Right, how do I get up there? I have to jump like a Neanderthal? Wait, can I knock it back? Can I swim? Can I just climb up here? I... Can I... I maybe I can climb up here. Okay. Good. I was really concerned there for a second. Ah, uh, I don't want to go back in this maze. There's scary hands in there. I can't do this. I can't deal with this. They're spooky! Spooky hands! Okay, now there's gonna be all sorts of fun keys behind this door, like a boss key. And, oh yeah, so this is a sweet ass room. And I'm gonna do something awesome, which is use my chicken and just shoot the. Oh, that doesn't work? That's bullshit. I assumed that any fire attack would work, but apparently you have to use dense fire. I seem to remember from playing this as a child... What Why? What was the point of him being here? Um, anyway, I seem to remember playing this as a child that I didn't know what to do, and those things just collapsed on me, and I think it instantly kills you, if I recall. Which is a total bummer, because there's no shortcuts in the Shadow Temple. You just have to go through all that again. Which is really why I hope I don't die. But I'm not too concerned, because I remember Bongo Bongo being really, really easy. So I think we're okay. What's this? Hearts? Fairies? Pff, rubies. Five rubies. Dumb. Dumb, dumb, dumb. Alright, let's get out of this place. Let's blow this pop stand. You can't get me, because there's an invisible wall here. I assume the other door is just a you know, waste of time, piece of heart, empty room, scary stuff, trap cards, that sort of thing. So I'm just going to head on back to the boss room, old bossy, and hope there's some fairies in there, because I'm a little light on fairies, and I don't want to die and have to do all this again, but I think we'll be okay. I'm actually doing better than I thought I would be for this whole three heart Zelda crap. I've only died a couple times, and they were uh, to skeletons and bosses, which are stupid. Now I'm jumping on Tetris pieces, apparently. Um, I feel like I'm gonna need some hover boots here. Which is great, because I love hover boots. Can I make that jump? I don't know, I don't want to risk it. Hover boots! Hover boots! Hover boots! Not again. Does whatever hover boots do. Can I fly over here? Almost died. Oh dear. Hover boots. Don't go down. Don't go down yet. Look for fairies, you dumbass. 
I see no fairies. So let's take off her boots because I don't think they help. But then again, what do I know? And we're gonna bongo some bongos. One of the more bizarre bosses in this game. Bum, 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 bum. Because Nintendo has this weird fetish with bosses being a pair of giant hands. As is illustrated in every game they've ever published, such as uh, Mario 64 has got a few, you know. Um, uh, Majora's Mask, I think? No, Majora's Mask doesn't have any. Uh, Wind Waker had some. Oh, yeah, this boss is super easy. I don't even think he can hurt you. Come on. Come at me, bro. Yes. Okay. I think, like, one more of these will do it. At least that stupid. Arrows! Arrows! Slice you! Slice and dice, slice and dice. Maybe one more. I got a. I just have a fairy, right? Okay, yeah, I'm fine. I'm totally fine. I don't like the noises Bongo Bongo makes. They creep me out. You have so much time to shoot his hands, like, this isn't even difficult. Ooh, a classic five-timer boss. Assuming next time's the last time. Unless it's six times, like Volvagi or whatever the shit that was. Alright, this will be five times. Hey! Oh. Just one more hit. Bongo Bongo. See you in the Congo. Grow some arms, you freak. Whoa. See, this boss goes out in style. He doesn't burn into flames. He just kind of disapparates into nothing. Don't touch the heart. Yay! Another one bites the dust. That's it for the Shadow Temple. Now off to the land of exposition to meet Impa and be terrified by her manliness. One more medallion to go, guys. Spirit. Just spirit. And then Ganon's castle. And then Ganon. And then, ooh, that'll be it. Unfortunately, Ganon's castle is stupid and long. The noble Zelda's Ocarina. You did a real bang-up job, Impa. You guarded that temple so well. Just full of evil spirits and horrible creatures. G great work. And they all just burst out and attacked the world. And then you went to go, what, like, save the temple? But you weren't even in there. Like, I did the whole thing myself. All of you sages are useless. Why don't all the sages just be like, Hey, Link, you want to be a sage? You can do a hell of a lot better job doing anything. Like... I'm assuming the sages have, like, this ascended power that, like, they're on a higher plane of existence. Like, just make Link that. He can just so he can solve all the problems. He can stop everything. Because sages don't do shit. The six wise ones. <laughs> Mark the six useless ones. Can't even protect Zelda. Your one job, your one purpose in life, to protect Zelda. You can't even do that. You're useless, Impa. But your medallion is probably the coolest one, because it's purple. It's a pretty sweet color. Impa awakens as a sage, huh? 
and adds her pathetic power to yours. Yeah, I'll do your job for you. Fine. Fine. Ah, well this calls for a good old-fashioned save. And next time, we're gonna head to that spirit place.